So now let's just complete the sign up screen. So first of all remove the packages which shows these red lines. Then import common methods. Of course we will do some changes. Okay, for now let's import the loading dialog. After successful registration, send user to dashboard. And remember this one, okay, which is dashboard dot dot. Login here, then we will send the user to the login screen. So this is our sign up screen. Of course, uh, now we will just run our application just to see how it looks. So I will open up my phone. And now before testing the application, we have to go to Android app and then uh, build.gradle. Inside the build.gradle, we have to change the minimum SDK version to 24. And of course, uh, here instead of example, you can type your name. My name is Muhammad Ali. I type my name and then drivers app. Okay. Before testing the application, we have to go to Android app and then uh, build.gradle. Inside the build.gradle, we have to change the minimum SDK version to 24. And of course, uh, here instead of example, you can type your name. My name is Muhammad Ali. I type my name and then drivers. So now let's just close build.gradle. Of course, in the next video, we will connect our this drivers app with Firebase. For now, we will just comment out this where firebase.initialize app because we want to check our app uh, UI of the drivers app for, for the sign up and sign in screen. So our app is running now. Here you can see this is our login screen. Let's go to our login screen. As you can see it is here we want it at the center. So our UI for the login screen, first of all here for this logo, we have to set the width and 140. Let's proceed with 220 will be enough. Okay. And before that is at the top of this image, we want to display some space from the top. So we can say size box of height uh, 30 as you can see let's proceed with 50 okay and then after it we have the logo and then after the logo we want to display some space Let's make this 60, this one will be 30. Okay, login as driver. Then we have email, your email, your password, the login button, and then register here. So this is our drivers sign in screen, the login screen. And when the user click on register here, it send us to the registration screen. So let's go now to the registration that is sign up screen. First of all, we will start from the user interface. We have to display basically a circle avatar where we will allow the user to choose any image from the phone gallery. So in order to implement that, we do not need this image.asset. We have to implement circle avatar. So for that purpose, what we can do, we can simply say here circle avatar. We will set the radius 80, 86 will be the radius for the circle avatar and we have to now say background image. The background image will be asset image 
and from the assets we will, from the images folder we will display an image by the name avatar man.png so you can say avatar man.png okay this is the image which we want to display and of course we will also uh, display a button okay which will be select image select image button okay and uh, also now what we need to do is we need to add a const modifier with it let's first see the UI let's go to sign up screen and this is how it looks okay and of course we will add some space from the top and that will be of height 20 let's make it 40 okay like this and then after the circle avatar also add some little space between the these two okay so it will be 10 will be enough select image or you can say choose image okay mean same now remove this uh, const from hit from here and make sure to wrap this inside a widget okay this choose image wrap this inside a widget and we will change this to gesture deductor like this and then on the on tap we will basically allow the user to choose image from phone gallery for now we will leave it empty of course we will implement it step by step so this is how our sign up screen is now after the choose image we have we can say your name your phone your email your password we will also add some further information and that will be getting the car information from a user so copy paste these three text editing controller for example the first thing will be the uh, car model that is which car the user has car or you can say vehicle vehicle model and then of course the vehicle color and then also the vehicle number plate or number you can say so what we can do now after the user password we can add this that is here okay so you can copy this field which is for the name okay alongside with the height size box height copy this so after the password here is the password okay after this size box we can copy paste one two three so after the password it is okay so the first one will be your uh, vehicle or you can say car your car model then your car color and then of course your car number now for the car model you know that we have vehicle model text editing controller then for the car color it is vehicle color text editing controller and then for the car number we have vehicle number so now let's see how it looks so you can see the sign up screen for driver that is 
your car model your car color and your car number and remove the fourth one which we copy paste okay which is after the your car number just remove this one we do not need it so now you can see car model car color car number then we have the sign up button